Acharya Prafula Chandra Ray, regarded as the father of Indian chemical science, was an eminent Bengali chemist, educationist, historian, industrialist, and a philanthropist. The Royal Society of Chemistry honored his life and work with the first ever chemical landmark plaque outside Europe. He was also the founder of India's first pharmaceutical company, Bengal Chemicals and Pharmaceuticals. Prafula Chandra Ray was born on 2nd August 1861 in the village of Raruli Kattipara, which was then situated in the eastern portion of Bengal Presidency of British India. In 1866, Prafula began his education in the village school run by his father and studied there until he was nine. After that, around 1870 or 1871, his father decided to move his family to Calcutta, where centers of higher learning were more easily accessible, and Prafula was admitted to the Hare School. In 1874, when Prafula was in the fourth standard, he unfortunately suffered a severe attack of dysentery and was consequently forced to postpone his studies. He then had to return to his ancestral home. He considered his disruption in his study as a blessing in disguise as it allowed him to read more widely in his father's well-equipped library. After two years in 1876, when Prafula was recovered from his illness, he returned to Calcutta and was admitted to Albert School. In 1878, after passing the school's entrance exam with a first division, he was admitted to Metropolitan Institution, which is now called Vidya Sagar College. He also studied physics and chemistry at the Presidency College, where chemistry became his favorite subject. His passion for chemistry and experimentation led him to set up a chemistry laboratory at home. Prafula Chandra Ray won a scholarship to the University of Edinburgh in the United Kingdom in 1882 and began his study in chemistry. After receiving his Bachelor in Sciences degree in 1885, Prafula remained at Edinburgh University to undertake research where he was awarded the DSC degree in 1887. Prafula Chandra Ray returned to Calcutta in 1888. Then he became an assistant professor of chemistry at the Presidency College in Calcutta in 1889. Ray was also the teacher to many pioneers of Indian science, including the likes of Meghnath Saha, Satyendranath Bose, Jnanendranath Mukherjee, and Jnan Chandra Ghosh. Around 1995, Prafula Chandra Ray started his work in the field of discovering nitride chemistry, which turned out to be extremely effective. In 1896, he published a paper on preparation of a new stable chemical compound called mercurous nitrite. He noticed the formation of a yellow crystalline solid with the reaction of mercury and dilute nitric acid. This work made way for a large number of investigative papers on nitrites and hyponitrites of different metals and on nitrites of ammonia and organic amines. This result was first published in the Journal of Asiatic Society of Bengal and the Nature magazine also immediately noticed this on May 28, 1896. One of Prafula Chandra Ray's notable contributions is also in ammonium nitrite synthesis. He proved that the pure ammonium nitrite is indeed stable by bringing to pass a lot of experiments and explained that it can later be sublimed even at 60 degrees Celsius without decomposition. At a conference of the Chemical Society in London, he submitted the result, Nobel Laureate, William Ramsey congratulated him for this achievement. Prafula was from the beginning interested in the work of early Hindu chemists. After reading the famous book Greek Alchemy by the French scientist Berthelot, 
his interest in hindu chemistry grew into a passion prafulla's interest in the ancient text led him to read many ancient books in sanskrit pali bengali and other languages after several years of study prafulla published his famous book the history of hindu chemistry in two volumes in 1902 and 1908 prafulla published the first volume of his autobiography life and experience of a bengali chemist in 1932 which was dedicated to the youth of india the second volume of this work was published in 1935 After the retirement of Prafulla from Presidency College in 1916 he joined Calcutta University and worked for more than 20 years Prafulla was a passionate and devoted social worker who wanted to uplift the masses through the miracle of science Prafulla Chandra Ray also went on to organize the Bengal Relief Committee which helped the Bengal famine and the flood struck people due to that event He also was a great supporter of the khadi material and also established many industries such as Bengal Enamel Works, National Tannery Works and the Calcutta Pottery Works. Prafulla believed that it was not enough for students to acquire degrees like Bachelor of Science or Master of Science so they should endeavor to acquire real knowledge. He was under the belief that students should rather get technical education and start their own business and he believed that young men should enter trade and industries by themselves. Acharya Prafulla Chandra Ray passed away on the 16th of June 1944 at the age of 83 and he will always be remembered as one of the greatest India has ever produced. Thank you all for watching this video. and to stay tuned for all our future uploads do hit the subscribe button and i'll see you in our next video take care